yeah so you want to make your uh, computer a bit faster so here are a couple of things that you might want to check so the first one today is um, startup programs because sometimes when you start your computer a lot of other uh, programs would want to start up with your computer so what you need to do is check for this um, programs that start up with your computer and then you disable them so to do that with um, Windows 10 and upward you just uh, click on control shift escape but for Windows 7 you need to okay let me just show you on the computer so we um, I'm using uh, Windows 10 so you do control shift escape and that comes up so we see all these are the programs that start up with your computer whenever you uh, switch them on so you can see all of this some of them has been disabled by me so um, for example had it been this has been um, still, okay let me just enable it so for you to disable it you just right click on that program and click on disable so whenever your computer starts the next time it will not start with your computer so like i said with windows 7 what you need to do is here you just type in run so when you type in run you type in ms config i'll just type that in m s config this is only for windows 7 now once you click that it brings this up but because this is windows 10 it would still ask you to go to uh, uh, open task manager but with windows 7 you find every of the program here so with uh, windows 10 it will ask you to go to task manager so you can still see all of them here so then you disable whichever program but mind you be careful so you don't disable the uh, necessary programs mm -hmm. and i discovered that with um skype with skype most times when you enable skype it, it makes your computer a bit slow so it's better to disable it and then you enable it when you need it so so let's go to the next one the next one is um run you go to run like this and you type in you type in services.msc services dot m s c like that and you click on it so here are some other programs that start up with your computer also so some of these services uh, come up with your computer so be careful also when you're trying to delete this ones because it might cause a bit of malfunction on your computer so if you know what you're doing yeah but if not i would just advise to just leave this but some of them like ea background services you know what it's um one of the gaming stuff so you can either leave it or you just um um make it uh, you see that some of them are automatic so all you need to do is right click on it and go to properties and then you see it here and then you put it back to manual so it will make your computer a bit more faster so yeah so I, w I won't be going into any technical um, um, things so that you don't uh, mess up your computer so the next one is to uninstall unused software if you have some unused software on the computer why not just uninstall them because when you uninstall them they uh, creates more space for your computer to work so to do that you just go to your search bar and go to control panel type in control panel control panel
so there it is at the top there so once you click control panel you see all of this sometimes it might be in small icons depending on your computer so what you need to do is just click back on control panel and then you will see uninstall the program so once you click on that you will find all the programs here so there are some programs that you might want to delete you find them here so I'll just look for one program that I might just delete here for the sake of the video so um, let me let me delete opera and no let me let me look for something that I can delete here okay let me delete this um, opera so all you need to do is click on it and right click on it and click on uninstall and it will remove that from your computer so that's the uh, another one then another one is always keep your softwares updated if you look at uh, my my previous video it says upgrade all your PC apps at once I would put a link up here for you to see so just click on that and I have all the videos um, the method for you to be able to upgrade all of your apps on your PC all at once so the next step is to go here sometimes you have a lot of, um, um, of, of files that uh, temporary files on your computer that is making your computer slow and also always try to delete items on your recycle bin they still take up a lot of space so for you to remove um, the uh, remove the temporary files you just go to your search bar and then you just click run type run and once you type run you type in percentage temp percentage and you click on it and here are items that needs to be deleted they are just temporary files so all you need to do is just click on control a to copy all of them and just delete so it calculates uh, um, what needs to be deleted so what you need to do here when you get this you just click on do this for all current items and skip and skip so that's it and the next one is prefetch you just click run and then you type in prefetch I have that already on my computer here so I just type so it tells you that you don't have access to this then you click continue um, it allows the administrator to do that then you just control A again delete then click do this and skip for every other item and that's it so I am very sure your computer will be considerably a bit more faster and one the last step is click on the files folder this pc and then you have your drives here so you right click on the drive and go to properties so when you come onto properties you click on disk cleanup so when you click on disk cleanup you get this so there are temporary internet files because i've just cleaned up some of the inter um, the temporary files so it's a bit lower here so you have all of this recycle bins temporary files i have over five gig on my recycle bin so all of that needs to go so with that you have all of this and then you just click clean up it takes a bit of time for you to for this to work it takes a lot of time so you have to be patient with it so once you click on that it calculates how, um, how many how much space 
Then once you click on OK here, it takes a bit of time. So look at that now. It's going to clean up about six gig of space. So which is um, which could have been making my computer slower. So yeah, um, I think this is about it for today. And I hope this video helps someone. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, leave comments below, and also share this video for your friends and family who would want their computer to be a bit, a lot more faster. Take a game for it from here. I'll see you in my next video. Bye for now.